Good afternoon, this is Bob Icino coming to you from the CME Group trading floor in Chicago. Talking energy futures, crude oil, huge jump in crude oil, over 3% today on the highs, got a high above 65.50, very significant to get back above that 65 level. And that is the biggest move since mid-February, only short by a couple of pennies from the February 12th move that we saw that caused the new mid-month rally that happened in February. And this has been a very strong driver of crude oil today. This move has been mostly on the President Xi Jinping comments from China, which sparked the idea that demand hopes were back into the market. Over the last few days, we've seen sort of a sell-off of crude oil from comments or a potential trade war that eased up yesterday on the over-the-weekend comments by President Trump and Chief Economic Advisor Larry Kudlow that seemed to be, they seemed to be very confident that there were going to be talks and a trade war was going to be averted. And then at the Bao Conference in China overnight, President Xi Jinping of China, and I'm paraphrasing, basically said they're going to be a much more open economy. They're going to increase imports into China, lower the requirements for foreign-owned corporations and foreign-owned entities to buy into China and put increased intellectual property rights in place. Now, according to people in China, all this has been said before, but the market certainly took it as a positive step. You see the demand potential coming back into crude oil, making this rally happen, and you saw it across the commodity space. We saw copper, aluminum, nickel, uh, natural gas, basically all the commodities rally from a demand-based perspective off of these Xi Jinping comments. President of China put this uh, at the forefront of his opening speech in the Bao Conference, and the market reacted very, very well. Now, there's also a news report from Bloomberg that the Saudi Arabian officials have been pretty quietly saying they're looking for $80 crude oil through 2019. Now, this is a Bloomberg report. It's not confirmed. There's no quotes from the Saudi officials. They put out a report about six to eight months ago saying they were looking for $70. Now, according to conversations had by the Saudi Crown Prince and the oil minister that they're looking for this $80 level in crude oil in order to launch the Aramco IPO. The Saudi Crown Prince has said that they're not delaying the IPO, they're just waiting for the right time. Everything is filed, all the laws have been passed, all the papers have been put in place, and the rules have been taken care of, and they're ready to launch the IPO when the time is right. According to Bloomberg, that time is at $80 crude oil. So that's putting a little bit of a bid behind crude oil as well as the sort of dollar correlation breaks down. Now we have seen lower dollar the last three days. Generally commodities move in the opposite direction of the dollar. But again, that's kind of broken down because dollar's been down for three days in a row and crude oil has kind of made its own path on outside factors. This is Bob Icino talking crude oils on an up 3% day, biggest day since mid-February from the CMA Group trading floor in Chicago.